Hi, I'm Lindsay, and today we are watching Freerin, episode 8. So in the last episode, uh, Freerin, Fern, and Stark headed into this town where there's a peace envoy going on between Lugner and his demons and Graf Granat. And the peace envoy is kind of just like a sham for Granat to kill Lugner. But anyways, Freerin um, could sense demons and, and said, it's on sight, bitch. Like, she was ready to fight. She was ready to do so. And she got thrown into a cell where she explains to Fern and Stark uh, how demons just use words to manipulate people into not killing them. And we see in a flashback that this demon child tried to do that. And it worked for them for a while until the demon killed the chief, the the village chief guy, and then they the Himmel and the party they realized that they just have to do it. They have, I mean, Freerin was ready, but that that this is what demons are like, and they have to kill them. They cannot hesitate. And yeah, so now yeah, Drat Drat. Um, the one of the little demons uh, with Lugner went to exterminate. Uh, Freerin and went into her cell where Freerin delivered such an amazing performance here saying that she is stronger than him and she is stronger than Aura the guillotine the demon that they are wanting to bring into the town once the defensive barriers are lowered so and Aura is a problem apparently from what I've heard here so yes um, I'm excited for this episode I did my hair like Freerin today because I have a feeling that in this episode, Freerin will both literally slay and metaphorically slay. So I'm excited for that. Because uh, this episode is called Freerin the Slayer. People have been hyping up the next three episodes. So I'm like, I'm ready to get into them. So yes, please like, comment, subscribe and all that. I'm almost, I'm so close to 3000 subscribers. So if you're enjoying my channel at all, uh, please subscribe. I would really appreciate it. Let's 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 get me to 3,000. Let's get into this episode, which I said already is called Fear in the Slayer. I'm excited for her. Okay, let's go. All right, we're getting this scene again. Mm -hmm. Sure you are. Sure. She's their one problem. <laughs> I am so ready to see this. The opening is just about to happen, isn't it? Doesn't seem like it to me. Oh, okay. <gasps> okay. Okay. Uh, she has... Okay. Okay, I was like, she, I wasn't sure if that was him or her that was prote protecting her neck. The strongest of demon kind spells? Okay. Sure. <laughs> she seems on. Bothered. Oh my god, Freerin. Oh my god, oh my god, what is she gonna do? <gasps> Get him. <gasps> Just like that. Yeah! <laughs> I love this for her. <gasps> you bitch. Oh shit! I mean, it was kill or be killed, you know? Like, she had to do it. She knows. Oh fuck. I knew it. I knew it. Uh, I hope so. I mean, they weren't. Oh god, but people are so quick to be tricked into. Uh oh, is that gonna be a problem? Oh fuck, she's so cool. Uh, I know her name means cold, and I'm like, I'm always like, oh, Furin is cold. The names. The names are really coming across in how they act. I love it. I love it. Oh, it's so good. Okay, let's go. Oh, look at these two just on a little date. Having a burger. Oh my god, they're so cute. Hmm. Oh god, and they would all be killed. 
She just wolfed down that burger. <laughs> They're cute. Yeah, get him, Fern. Yeah, she is. She's. She knows. She's intuitive. She. I mean, Freeran told her. Come on, Star. Get to it. Well. Well. I believe Stark, though. I got it. I, I believe him. Mm. Yeah. The only concern... The only concern he has is Firin. That's how confident... Oh my god, Stark. What is... <laughs> so embarrassing. <laughs> oh, in front of your, like, future... Okay. Okay. Didn't. <laughs> Didn't need the cross shot. It's okay to be scared, Stark. It's okay. Fear is okay. Yes, good for you. Ew. Yeah. Stark, what? You are socially awkward, okay? You're both weird. They're both weird. They kind of deserve each other. They're both weird. Uh-oh. She's not detecting it. Okay, last time I sum saw her, like, summoning this, like, black orb thing. They are the right hand men of Lady Aura, her executioners. Love his ascot. I still love it. Mm, does he know who she is? No. Didn't seem like it last episode. No, 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 don't be sympathetic. Mm, okay. <gasps> Are they gonna blame her? Oh, they're gonna twist it. They're gonna twist it. They're gonna twist it. They're gonna twist it so. Locating magic. Please don't. Please just. Uh. Okay, lying, lying. Mmm. Come on, Granat. Come on, Granat. Be you're smarter than this. I don't know you that really. Okay, okay. Yes, so, okay. Good for you. Who actually killed? Yeah. Hell yeah. Yup. Liar. He's gonna spread lies. Hmm. <gasps> oh no! <gasps> oh my god, he's using blood manipulation! <laughs> no! Oh, I hear Sukuna now. <gasps> oh my god, that is so cool. Granat, I am scared for you. Oh god. <laughs> he doesn't have to pretend to get along with humans. His eyelash I said oh my god because his eyelashes are so beautiful. Mm. Mm, interesting. <gasps> e oh shit. Oh, I'm so glad Granat caught on. <gasps> Uh, I thought he was gonna chop his head off, so... Oh, we are wild beasts. He's important for the defensive barrier, right? Yeah! Beautiful. Oh my god, I need these two to... Oh! There she is! <laughs> there she is! Mm, she's on the low down on the down low right now. Yeah, she didn't. They turn into man monoparticles and disappear. So he's disappeared now. He'd already killed it. Oh, she thinks that they're gonna think that it was her. Yeah. 
Right. Mm -hmm. Doesn't look good. Doesn't look good. Mm -hmm. That's crazy because they actually, Granat was smarter. Oh, yeah, come on. Come on, girl. Hmm. Come on! Ooh, shit. Oh. Mm. Okay. Stark. Uh, Stark. Look how disappointed Fern is. <laughs> She's so fucking done with him. Oh, Fern. This episode is my emotions all over the place. Now, if they put in a Himmel flashback, then I'm really gonna lose it. Don't do this to me. Okay. Oh, a great day. Is it Aura? Mm. Okay. Oh. Oh. Is it is it her uh her army? <gasps> okay. There she is. I've seen her before in pictures. I hate, I hate fighting powerful opponents. <gasps> Ooh, I've never seen that. I love it. <laughs> I love that look for her. <laughs> she looked crazy. Oh, Furin is so cool. And I've only seen a, like a tiny, tiny bit of how cool she is, but she's so cool. Ah, Stark, you're just. Oh my gosh. Fern does what she has to do, you know? <laughs> I can see how he's still a little cowardly. Oh, but I'm ready to see him fight. Yo. Nice. That was cute. That was so cute. His little face. She did not need his help at all. Damn it, Fern. <laughs> Let him look cool. Hmm. I mean, Stark is... I don't know the full extent of how strong Fern is right now, but I mean, Fern's her her master, so. Love how they make their clothes look wet still, like they haven't dried right away. Not wow, okay. She would have a spell for that. Mages are so sneaky. Oh, I'm so excited. They're gonna fight Lugner. I love that. Okay. Qual! Oh, you know, I remember him! Right. Zoltrak. <laughs> A single kind of magic. Mm. His was killing magic. Okay. They evolve as well. Hmm. Fenrir's prevented demons. Oh, from invading. Wow, her impact in this story is wild. No wonder she's called a legendary mage. <gasps> yes. Oh, that's a beautiful barrier. It's like a veil. That's crazy. She really did that. She really did that. I despise geniuses. Okay, well, I don't know about that. Mm. I don't know if he's not gonna... Yeah, he's not gonna do that. I think you can do whatever you want. And he's not... I don't know what he's going to do if he doesn't. Further torture. Mm. I feel like what would get him is something more emotional than that, but I also don't know his character that well. 
Uh oh, a grimoire. Oh oh. oh. Damn, Granite, you look kind of good. <gasps> Stark. Nice. Okay, sir. Um, you're not dead yet. Just do it. Oh, he. Okay, be careful. <laughs> be careful. Don't hurt him. Yes. It's valiant. Oh. Fear is just part of it. I'd be more scared of someone who doesn't fear have fear. Oh my god, the rope is like... Oh no. Mmm. Okay. No, Granat! You gotta get out of here! Oh, okay. Well, shit. He's trying to save your life. Okay, that's good. Mm. <gasps> yes, yeah, star good for you. Oh, uh oh. Uh. <gasps> He's really, really shaking. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! The demons are gonna like use that to their advantage somehow. Uh, come on, Stark. Well, Fern is around. <gasps> oh, he's not looking. Yeah. He sees him as such a non problem. Fern, girl, where are you? <gasps> Look at that little crouch. Oh, shit. Well. Don't underestimate humans. <gasps> I mean, that's pretty cool. I can't even lie. <laughs> I just hear Sakuna. <laughs> Fern. Fern, where are you? Yes! yes. <laughs> I'm ready. Get him. <gasps> yeah. Oh shit, she looks like Fearin right now. I love it. I love it. Oh, Fearin, you're so cool. Ooh. This spell. <gasps> Is it killing magic? Is it Zoltrak? Zoltrak! Zoltrak! <laughs> oh, that's ordinary offensive. <gasps> Zoltrak. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. That it's cool to see Zoltrak coming back up. <gasps> Fur is so cool. Look for her. I'm so proud of her right now. Although I do not know what Lenny is capable of. You kill the warrior. My blood is on those two. Oh, they can sense them? We won't. Oh, no. Yeah, Zoltrak is crazy. Modified to specialize in killing de- <gasps> Ooh, taking a spell from a demon and then flipping it on its head so that it's a demon killing spell? Cool. Mm. <gasps> yes, 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 He knew her. <laughs> yes, he remembers Freerin. Yeah. Oh, 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 shit. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. 
<gasps> Humanities analysis of Zoltrek. Oh, yes. Okay, it's what I thought. <gasps> She's so beautiful. Fear in the Slayer. <laughs> what in the geniuses I despise. I am so excited. What a good episode. Oh my god, that built it up so well. I mean, I had a feeling that it was going to lead to this, and I remember someone telling me that Zoltrak was going to be important again. So I kept it in my brain. Um, that is so cool. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, okay. <gasps> so he had seen her before. The one who's killed more demons than anyone. Freer in the Slayer. <gasps> So cool that Fern like reminds reminds him of Freerin. Oh, that's so cool. I had a feeling that Fern was gonna show up there and do something. It's funny how she just calls it ordinary offensive magic <laughs> when it's like a demon killing spell. Uh, it's like a huge deal. And that okay, so Freerin and the hero party, the one who sealed Qual, um, it, and then she's like a huge reason why they and. The, uh, for the analysis of his spell, Zoltrak. And she took her and I guess everyone else like took that spell that was used as killing magic and then made it targeted so that it was a demon killing magic. <gasps> that is some fucking queen behavior. No Himmel in this episode. It's fine, I guess. Maybe in the next episode. Okay. I mean, this fight is not over. It was Aura, one of the seven sages of destruction. Okay, I don't know shit about Aura. Well, she, she, so Aura is about to face off against Firin, and she's like, Firin had that really cool face there, and she was thinking about having to kill Aura, and that she would have to get it done quickly. Ooh. You could really feel her hatred for demons. Um, and it's like in a, not in a like upfront, like, oh, I hate demons, meh, sort of way. It's like very, it's more subdued and it's almost like she's enjoying it. Um, I don't like, I mean, not that I think she would, she likes demons, but she's kind of like enjoy. She's, she's like, she's ready to do so. She, when they're around, she is ready to get them. I appreciate that fear and tr fully trust in Stark and Fern to take care of Lugner and, um, Linny. I, I'm that's like some good trust because Lugner seems like very powerful and they seem to notice that but she fully trusts them and rightfully so since uh, Fern was able to fire off Zoltrak which is a demon killing spell and is able to like completely mask where she is um that is very interesting Stark Stark in this episode just made me laugh <laughs> like I don't know he's so funny I mean I under like his whole thing with the fear of him shaking. I'm glad that didn't just like go away after fighting a dragon once because that would be kind of like where what you really like character your char entire character developed within the span of like 20 minutes. That doesn't make sense. Of course, he's going to still be shaking and nervous and being scared is part of being alive. Like that totally makes sense. I wouldn't. It's just that Stark is kind of like goofy and I appreciate that he's goofy. Uh, him and Fern are both just weirdos. She is weird. He, they're both weird together. But I like them together. I like their how they're like bonding and stuff like that. They both kind of just like deal with each other's weirdness. I don't know why I find I find Fern so weird, but she's just so like stone faced, and he seems like a little put off by it sometimes. But that's just who she is. I really, really appreciated that. We didn't have this- oh god, I just clicked on the part where he was rubbing his crotch with the handkerchief. Um, that I did not need to see again. Uh, so, he- I really appreciated that Granat didn't just immediately blame Freerin. He actually was, like, logical about it and was like, Well, when we first arrested her, she didn't resist it. Like, she did not resist the guards. She knows that would be, like, a huge offense, so she didn't do that. So her escaping and killing a guard seems out of character based on, like, what we've seen from her so far. So, and him being, like, and one of your demon friends, um, has just totally disappeared. And so he put the pieces together very quickly, and 
immediately blame them, which was refreshing instead of it, what I thought could happen with what Freerun was expecting them to believe. I'm so glad that didn't happen. Uh, Granat was smarter than I gave him credit for, and uh, maybe I'm just more like and too much, and too much like Freerun in a lot of ways. But I appreciated that he saw past that. Uh, Lugner's voice, now that I know that it's Sukuna, oh my god, I love it so much more. I also love that he uses blood manipulation. Uh, just makes me think of Choso. If you're a Jujutsu Kaisen fan, you you know, you know, you understand me. Um, but yeah, he... Eventually, Lugner was cornered and was like, well, I guess I can't just use words anymore. I have to use my my strength as my, my demon strength. Um, and Granat, I'm proud of him. He, he fully accepted everything in this episode. He dealt with things how they should be dealt with. And uh, yeah, I really respect that for him. I'm excited to see what Aura is all about. Like, what is her deal? Why do they want to destroy the city, first of all? Yeah, like why? What's what's the deal with hating this seat, this this town or this city? Why do they want to destroy it? Just because they're demons and they want to take their place? Like, um, I don't know. I just don't know anything about Aura yet, except for the fact that she was holding a scale and laughing. Uh, <laughs> that's all I know, and that I've seen her before. Uh, it's cool to see Qual again. I was I, I someone did like mention before that Zoltrag came up again. So like we would get to see Qual again. I know his name is Qual now. I'm not calling him Zoltrag. That was a stupid mistake. But it was uh nice to see a reference to his spell again because like, his spell like that happened a while ago, but his spell was like a big deal. Like it, it changed like so much in the magic world. The fact that she was a huge Firun was like a huge part in making that spell become a spell against demons, not for demons. Oh, that's pretty impressive. I'm very. She's just so freaking cool. She's cute. She's cool. She's got it all. Um, damn it, Himmel and her would have been so freaking cool together. Why? Why? <laughs> Why did this have to happen like this? Mm, she, they could have been together and been so happy and been real cool together. We're in the Slayer. I'm, I'm excited to see her um, in the next- Oh god. Oh god. Oh god, I'm so excited to see her in the next episode. It's her against an entire army right now and, and Aura. Uh, she slew more demons than anyone else in history and contributed a major an uh, analysis of Zoltrek for humanity. Oh. I look, Aura. She said she was stronger than you. And she was willingly going up against you and an entire army and you're still smiling? If I were you, I'd be fucking scared. <laughs> I would be scared. Oh, such a good episode. I really, really enjoyed it. Good, they're really, this anime is so good at making like less serious, more calming episodes or moments and like really good at handling emotional moments. And now I'm noticed, and now we're getting to these like intense, like more fantasy battle stuff and magic and getting to see that is a whole other part of the fantasy genre uh, with armies and all of this. Like, there's so much going on here that fits this fantasy genre so well. I hope this makes sense. And they're doing it well, too. They got they got everything done down so well. I, like, the characters, the emotions, the fighting, everything is so good. I have been recommending this anime to anyone who hasn't seen it. I've been watching the dub, too, and um once i'm caught up with these episodes here i'm probably watching like three or four in one sitting today once i'm caught up with them i'm gonna watch them dub too because the dub is really really good and help me realize that i was pronouncing a lot of names wrong uh but yeah this was a very very good episode um it's pretty much all i have to say for now I'm, I'm like ready to go on the next one hopefully you enjoyed this um reaction and discussion of this episode and enjoyed the fact that I attempted to do my hair like Freerun today even though the headphones completely cover it. Um, so yes, thank you for watching. Uh, please comment, like, subscribe. The whole thing. And yes, uh, I'm just about to watch the next episode so see you later. Bye bye.